Gets big overhands. Beautiful win from the open Boom. position, people. Yes, he's gonna say, Crew goes out on Leo Latifi! St. Crew. The sledgehammer is coming. Yo, I can't believe Ilya Latifi's in town. I gotta go meet him. Let's go. Just made it to Balaban Fitness. I'm about to meet with Ilya Latifi, one of the top contenders in the UFC for a light heavyweight division. I'm about to find out all about his life and hopefully get a workout in. Brought my gear because you always gotta be prepared to walk into the world of a fighter. Yo, look at that champ throw hands right now. Yo, Ili. What's up? Nice to meet you. How Thanks are you for guys? having us out here. Cool, good to see you out here. Nice to be here. So what have you been doing out here so far? How's it Just been? Just working out, having a nice time. Yeah. Look at him, he's like twice my size. Just like expected. <laughs> I've always wanted to know, why do they call you the sledgehammer? Why do you think? I don't want to find out. I don't want to find out. All right, so let's find out what ely has been up to training-wise. You know, I wanted to just congratulate you on your win against OSP. That was sick. Well, you know, every fight, you got to prepare yourself for, for all situations. So I was prepared for standing up, taking a stand up, or taking it on the ground, you know, and it worked out perfectly, so I can't complain. Like in OSP, you, you decided to like choke him out. Why did you do that? Is that because you feel more comfortable grappling or...? I mean, uh, I, I, I knock out people uh, and I submit people. So whatever situation I'm into, uh, I'm going to try to go for that finish. And I felt I had it so good, you know, when I get in that position and I just went for it. Perfect. So what's on the menu today training-wise? What are you going to do? Today we're going to do some technical pads. Can I get in a little bit? Maybe like... You can try. Yeah? Yeah. So psyched! You want the jab? Yeah. For knowing the distance? Yep. And then you throw it over here. Bang. Straight over. Over the top. Yeah. Alright, let's go. One more time. Boom. Lights out. For sure. You're a beast. I'll show you a sledgehammer. The difference with a fighter and other sports is like when a fighter is injured, he pretends he's not injured. But in other sports, you have people that are not injured, they pretend they are injured. So I mean, <laughs> this is the mentality you have to have as a fighter, you know? Always grinding, always overcoming those obstacles in life. Life is a big fight. It's just like a fight in the octagon. Life has its struggles we have to go through, and those struggles are are different for all people, you know. I have my struggles, you have yours. But you still have to go through them. It's easy to train when you're fresh, when you're strong, when you're healthy, when you can eat good. Then it's easy to train. I can train all day long and I, if I can eat whatever I want and I'm healthy and I don't have injuries and I don't have to think about nothing else. It's being able to be hungry, being tired, being stressed, being injured and still keep going on. Okay, like, don't tell anyone, but when I saw Elir, I really just wanted to do this. 